There she is! <laughs> oh my god! Wow, chicka, wow, wow! Tatooine never, never saw this coming. Okay, HK. You better show us some good stuff out there. Oh, this must be the Jawa that the person was talking about. You there, of your kind. Can you help Easy's of Jawa? There are troubles from the ghosts among the sands. Could you be clearer? I'm having trouble understanding you. Statement. It is doubtful he can be clearer. Wait, what? Their language is difficult even for droids. He is using a trade language to try and help. The trouble is yours, not of Jawa. We must use a language of trade because you listen complicated to what we say simply. Why wouldn't I understand your true language? That is not a problem for Jawa to have for you. You have the ears that do not listen. Oh, that's deep. What is it that you want, Jawa? Easy as I am, leader of the tribe that is mine. You are the same in kind, a leader that stands before your tribe. There are troubles that we have. The giants made of sand. They are horned ghosts that take us away. Giants made of sand? Sand people? That is how you know them. Giants are different for us, we being smaller. People of sand are who I mean. So, Izzy's? Izzy's? What do you want me to do? There has been no help given by asking the great group that digs with machines. Now Izzy's asks, asks you. I ask that you find us, and then bring away from the people of sand. Then we will offer a trade with you. Long have we scavenged among you and those that came before. We have things that you would like for this service. Aha! I'm looking for something called a star map. Can you help? These are things I know, yes, from those that came before. The guide to lights far and away. I can tell you. Please, first help the tribe of Izzes among the people of the sand. Oh, and we will trade what we each need. Okay, I'll check it out when I leave the city. Goodbye. Izzes hopes that you have the luck you need. Okay, this is exciting. Also, the Izzes was mentioning... The ones that came before, which I bet was Revan and Malik. Must be. Izzis says he knows where the star map is and will trade you the information for help rescuing his tribe members from the Sand People Enclave. Okay, we've got this! Master? <gasps> oh, dark side! Oh! I'm gonna auto-level up. Excuse me, please let us through. We have authorization from the Circa Corporation, aka Amazon. No one leaves Anchorhead without proper authorization. Well, guess what? I have proper, 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 proper authorization. Well, let's see it. Come on. Here's my hunting license. All right. I'll just scan that yes. and you're off. I'll keep it on file, too. Good luck out there. You'll need it. Wow, thanks. <laughs> It's actually Jin. Hello there. You're heading out into the desert? You're a hunter, right? You must be if you've been allowed to leave Anchorhead. When you see Tannis, and I know you know him, tell him his wife hopes he enjoys the anniversary gift. What? Look at me when you're talking to me, person. Why do you think I would know him? Don't play dumb. You're just another of his playthings down at the hunting club. I know your type through and through. Well, he can do what he wants. He'll get what he deserves. I bought my own license just so I could see that he did. Uh, okay. Anniversary gift? What are you talking about? Just a little something to remember me by. Something that symbolizes our years together. Something that will blow up in his face. Of course, he'll never understand how appropriate it is. He can't talk his way out of this one. He's not smart enough. You sound like you're planning to kill him. Oh, I'm through planning. I just left him a little mess that he has to take care of. Oh dear. If he's smart, he'll be just fine. But he's not smart. Um, I have to go. I'm sure you do. Like I said, when you see him, tell him his wife Marlena says hello. Oh dear. <laughs> what is going on out there? Oh gosh, this does not look good. Anyone out there? Could you help? I seem to be, uh doomed <laughs> yeah it doesn't look good hold on there how about talking to me before you go missing with those things i need your help i was gonna try to make them not attack you what is going on with them they're just like bopping around hey there thanks for stopping i appreciate it i've been stuck without water for hours wasn't looking good i don't remember you from plaza's club you new to anchorhead 
Could you maybe help me get out of here? Wait, is this... Oh, this is Tannis? What happened here? Well, uh, it would appear that I've worn out my welcome with my wife Marlena. She fixes my droids. <laughs> Fixed them good this time. Commentary. One would hope the female is better at repairs than Yukalaka. I still would like to crush his neck, master. I triggered some sort of trap she programmed. She probably figured I wouldn't be smart enough to get out. There she was right. Hmm, what do you want me to do? The wife put a kink in my battle droids. They're in some sort of discharge loop. And if I move from this spot, they're threatening to blow up. She knew I wouldn't know how to fix them. If you try to do some repairs, they don't care if you move. It's just me who's stuck. I say leave him. You're pretty heartless for such a pretty lady, you know? I take it back. Oof. Let's congratulate his wife. Commentary. I say we blast the meat bag and save you the trouble, master. What's with all the droids lately? My wife get to you too? Negative. I just don't like organic meat bags. <laughs> Except for the master, of course. Uh, I'd uh, really appreciate a bit of help, please. Oh my gosh. I don't have time for this right now. Goodbye. What? Oh, right. Thanks. I guess I'll just die. Come on, help a guy out. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> you do not talk to Bastila like that, okay? Okay? Hello, miners. Mining team captain. Should we talk to these people? Who are you? Ah, doesn't matter. Can you handle a blaster? It may attack again at any second. I doubt we could hold out our own against another wave of them. I would assume this was done by the sand people? You would be right. Came out of nowhere. Wait, <gasps> Here they come again. Oh no. How did it do that? Oh no. <gasps> no, we're not supposed to attack them. Leliana, look alive. Come on, Lel. I'm pulling an Anakin here. Oh. Ooh. What? What? Ah! There's another wave! Go, go, go! Whoops! <laughs> well, that was a little bit off target there. Well, I feel like we didn't really have a choice here to fight them. They were hostile. Come on! More! More! Oh my gosh. Just chug the med packs. Oh no, the miner died! Oh no, this isn't good. Advanced med pack! Like now! Okay. Whew. Okay, I think they're I think we're done. Hmm? Thanks for your help. I hope there's no more of those animals out there. That was intense! HK does have some bloodlust going on. What does that even say? Hulak ra Raid? Oh dear. Oh! A small group of Zan people ambush you! Wait! Can we speak? Uh oh. Why are they blue? Elite warrior? Oh my goodness. We're done. We are done. It's over. No, no, no. Stop. Oh! Dang it! <laughs> Wait, this wasn't even a refuse pile that I could loot? All for nothing? Let me die under here, please! Oh my god! What? Hello? Don't let me die under here, please! Anyone! Oh my gosh, where are you? I hear you! Marco! Oh my gosh, I cannot move! <laughs> We got you good now! Wait, what? Squee! <laughs> what? I'm so confused. We did a good ambush and then you better pay. Maybe 500 credits now, you die otherwise. Wait, what? Where's the person that we rescued? Wait, so we- it blew up? Wait! Did we mess that up? Oh, It was a trap! <laughs> it's a trap! So they ambushed us by making us think there was someone trapped, and then we went up to it, and it blew up. I see, I see. Okay. 
We did a good ambush, and you, and you better pay maybe 500 credits now. You die otherwise. <laughs> I actually truly don't have 500 credits. <laughs> I'm like 300 right now. <laughs> and if I refuse to pay you anything? This isn't tough to figure out, you know. You don't pay, we bury you here. Yeah, out here in the sand. But I don't like sand. Perhaps I could persuade you not to do this? What? Why would we stop? You look pretty weak right now. We got you good. If, I, if you let me go, I'll tell others how smart you are. You want to let me go. You got what you came for. We let you go now. We got what we wanted. Yeah, we sure did. Oh my gosh! We did a force persuade! Uh, Gurk, they didn't give us nothing. Oh, dang it! We didn't persuade all of them? <laughs> Shut up, we got what we wanted. Now we go. That's how this works. Yeesh! Oh my gosh! Nailed it. Nailed it! Wow. That was a brain teaser for me. <laughs> I'm here. Surprise! <laughs> Taste! Oh my gosh, look at her blocking the blasters. Ooh. Oh, they're not elite warriors. Oh, this is an elite warrior. Uh oh. I love that haste. Oh gosh, there's more! Go, go, go! Queen of flips. Oh my gosh. So good. Every time. Oh my gosh, there's more! Ah! <laughs> Let's just queue up all of the cures. Ow. Oh my gosh. That was a workout. <laughs> yes! Sand people clothing! Okay, 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 here we go. You have acquired sand people robes. They should allow you to pass yourself off as a sand people warrior, at least from a distance. They may make entering the sand people enclave a little easier. All of the non-droid members of your party would have to be wearing the robes for the disguise to work. Since you don't have robes big enough to fit Zalbar, his presence would certainly give you away. <laughs> One more. <laughs> okay, let's put on our disguises. Hey, hey! <laughs> this is awesome. To the Sand People territory, the Eastern Dune Sea. <gasps> what the? Oh, because none of us can detect traps? Of course. Why did I have to bring this guy with me? I'm sorry. I want my team back. Horrified proclamation, how dare you suggest leaving HK behind? I'm sorry. I just love my Jedi squad. Corpse. Parts! Yay. Sand people turret. Okay, we made it to the on we made it to the enclave. We're gonna save. Let's go in. Okay. They are astounded that we are here. Your disguise may have allowed you to pass the turrets outside, but it's ineffective at close range. Interjection. One moment. Yes. I believe I understood that, Master. It may not have been his intention, but he did actually communicate something. Oh my gosh, the sass! Quickly, tell him that we're not a threat! Translation. Result. I believe I have succeeded in confusing him, Master. We have shown an interest not common among outsiders. Hey! Apologize for being here. Say that we want peace. Translation. Translation. He is expressing disbelief, as am I, but his duty requires that he report to his chieftain. Extrapolation. Okay. It would seem that we are at least worthy of curiosity for the moment. I would much rather this get bloody, Master, but it is your call. <laughs> I would much rather this get bloody, Master. Okay, the, ch the chieftain's tone is obvious. He clearly despises all outsiders. Oh dear. Translation. I can translate with some guarantee of accuracy that he is demanding to know why he should let us survive this encounter, Master. <laughs> with some degree of accuracy. Tell him we want a peaceful solution. Translation. 
Wait, I love how we're just wearing our undies now. <laughs> Translation. He claims he has no reason to believe you, Master. Your kind have tainted this land with machines and uncaring, ignorant feet. Translation. True. He requires proof of good faith. We of course. We must make a contribution to his people that shows we are not a threat. Shall I blast him now, Master? Ask him what it is he wants. Translation. Side quest time! He is endearingly murderous. That's a great way to put it, Daniel. Translation. He plans to move his people farther from Anchorhead, but they need to build up stores of water first. He says you must aid him. Translation, he wants moisture evaporators from the Zerka. If you deliver them, he will order that his people reduce their attacks on miners. Oh gosh. How are we going to kind of convince the Zerka Corporation to sell us these? Oh my gosh, Pascal's wearing her underwear too! Scandal! Oh, you guys can't see her face. You can see, like, her torso. My face is blocking her. Sorry. <laughs> I am censoring out some Bastila stuff right now. <laughs> Tell him we will get his vaporators. Translation. There she is! <laughs> oh my god! Translation. He doesn't believe us, be really. To re the when we have the with us. Translation. We are to be escorted <laughs> outside. He will wait, but he doesn't believe we are coming back. Wow, chicka, wow, wow. Oh my gosh, look at this crew. Tatooine never, never saw this coming. Okay, well, should we put our disguises back on? I know Liliana's like ready for like a bike ride. She literally, she looks like a biker, like a cycler. <laughs> She's a Peloton model! Laliana, Jedi, Peloton model, saver of the universe. <laughs> Ooh, should we wear a dark Jedi Knight robe? Oh my gosh, look at her! She looks good in dark Jedi robes, let me say. I don't know yet. Like, we haven't- the only person we flirted with was Karth, and it was very uncomfy. So I- I don't know. I was hoping Bastila, but she doesn't seem to have shown any interest. Juhani is really nice, so I'd be happy with Bastila or Juhani. Karth, I'm just like not convinced yet on him. I just want to romance Bastila, but I just- I have a sneaking suspicion that she is- she doesn't swing Leliana's way. Wah. <laughs> Where to? Let's go back. Let's go to the- the- the Dune Sea. There was another area. The Eastern Dune Sea. Yes, that's where we want to go. Ooh, the Eastern Dune Sea continues to a barren horizon. The occasional stone appears to be marking a path, but the logic of how they are placed is indecipherable to an outsider? Oh! Okay, so I guess we need that information from the Jawa to go out there. I, I definitely- I genuinely like all of the characters, like, in their own ways, you know? Karth is annoying, but... I will give him a chance to grow on me. Okay, we have to go to the Zerka office. Great. It's like going to the DMV. You must gather your party before adventuring forth. Bastla, did you sneak away on us again? She's gonna come running around the corner at some point, hopefully. But yeah, there she is. <laughs> I'm trying to do like a real like first playthrough. It's so, like if we mess up a romance and we end up not romancing anyone, like so be it. Bastila tripped. <laughs> she tripped and we just forgot her down the road. <laughs> yes, what is it? If this is about mining or sand people, you go to the Zerka officers. I just manage the storehouse. We need moisture stuff. What do you have available for purchase? Was there something specific you were looking for? You seem like you're looking for unique things. Do you have any moisture vaporators? I may, but that is not something I usually sell to spacers. You don't look like a moisture farmer. What do you want them for? Uh-oh. Oh, do we- do we reveal our cards, friends? That is the question. That's not really your concern, is it? No, I suppose not. It wouldn't have mattered. Well, let me tell you what I have then. Whew. Well, I have two of the finest vaporators that Zerka Corporation produces. Of course, they only produce one model right now. The price is 400 credits for the pair. I won't break them up. They function best when linked together. Oh, shoot! We need to sell some stuff. <laughs> Could you be persuaded to lower the price? Well, I don't think that's very likely. I have to cover my costs, you know. Zerka's costs, not yours. Who cares about their money? I can't do it. I just can't. You'll have to come up with the money. 
Okay, okay, let's sell some stuff. One eternity later. Okay. Now we can afford them. I'll take the moisture vaporators for 400. Fine, fine. I'll assume you'll be able to handle the deployment of them. They are surprisingly light. It is a pleasure doing business with you. Do come again. Okay, we got him. Oh no. Oh no. Don't tell me I sold something good. I didn't sell something good. Okay. Whew. Don't attack me. There are so many of these critters. I'm going this way. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh heck. Oh dear. Uh oh. This person is disgusted by your presence among his people. Extrapolation. This guard doesn't appear honored to have the job of greeting us. <laughs> Tell him we have the moisture converters, HK. Translation. Translation. He will take us before the chieftain, as he was instructed to do. Okay, here we go! If you can read anything of the Sand People's chieftain's emotions, it seems that he is surprised that you have returned. We're back. Translation. He did not expect us to return, Master. He wonders if we have brought the moisture evaporators. Of course we have. Tell him that we have the his vaporators. Translation. <clears throat> Translation. He does not trust you, Master, but you have done more than any other outsider. They will not attack, and he grants you his chieftain's gaffy as reward. Translation. The attacks will be reduced, and he will allow you to explore this enclave, but be warned that any lack of respect will result in death. Okay. I have a few questions for him. Protocol. If you truly want this sadly peaceful arrangement to continue... This sadly peaceful arrangement. Ask. ask about the star map. Translation. <laughs> Translation. He says that what you seek is far from here in the eastern <gasps> sea. He will give you a map so you can find your way. Yeah! Translation. His people found it but didn't scavenge it because a crate dragon took up residence in the excavation. Oh gosh. I knew it. I knew you we were gonna have to fight a freaking crate dragon! <laughs> crate dragon? What is that? How do I pass it? Translation. <laughs> Translation. Your ignorance isn't his concern. He <laughs> claims there is a hunter that wanders the area sometimes and that you should ask him. Translation. The hunter is a Twi'lek. He will be in the eastern dune sea somewhere. Perfect. Tell him farewell for now. Translation. Oh my gosh, yes! The Manda- I was just thinking of the season two we premiere. Are free to leave. Okay, we are free to leave. Goodbye. Oh my gosh, what? Oh, this is a whole area! <gasps> Hello, Bantha! Oh my gosh. A rag pile? Hmm. Should we- should we open it? Bantha fodder. <laughs> nice. Exit to Dune Sea! Well, it's nice that they won't attack us anymore. <laughs> we can get our Jedi squad up and running again! As much as I love HK's dialogue. I love our triple Jedi action squad. It's just, it's my happy place. <laughs> my Jedi ladies. What can I say? I'm a simple woman. Okay, to the east. Oh wait, we need to switch our party. I'm sorry, I need my Jedi women. It's just how it is. <gasps> Welcome back, Juhani. <laughs> the ability to speak does not make one intelligent. <laughs> Qui-Gon. What a legend. A sass legend. I really want to see, I wanted to see more of Qui-Gon, you know, like, he just, yeah, he had a lot of, like, sass potential as, like, an interesting character, and, like, I feel like it just, just seeing him and Anakin and Obi-Wan together would have been lovely, you know what I mean? Okay, something is going on up here. It does not look good. <laughs> I'm tired of waiting, Comad. How big can this dragon of yours be? I'm going in. What? It's right there! You can see it! <laughs> What? Look, you can see the dragon, dude! It's huge! 
Greetings to you, human. I believe I saw you at Anchorhead. I thought I would see you on the dunes. You look like a hunter. Perhaps you are interested in the ways of the hunt? Will you help me? I've tracked a very special beast to its lair. A great dragon, the largest of the Tatooine desert predators. It is an honored creature to hunt, although we must use unorthodox methods today. I'm looking for a star map. It may be in this dragon's lair. I have no knowledge of that, but there may be something in there. There are signs that this lair was purposefully dug out. Oh. Crates are opportunistic and may have lazily moved into someone else's excavation. Of course, we must remove him to see. Why do you want me and not another hunter? You are here, and they are not. I also didn't know the size of my quarry until I was tracking it. And perhaps there are other reasons. I tried to get the help of another, but you saw him die in the lair. He lacked experience and, more importantly, patience. I usually hunt for the skill of it, but must make an exception today. I want newcomers to understand the proper intent behind the hunt, no matter the methods, the methods we use. Okay. I'll help. Give me more information about how. We must bait the great beast out of hiding and ambush him swiftly. There is no room to engage him in the lair, and his hide will repel blaster fire. Oh, good thing we don't have any blasters. I've placed mines around the mouth of the cave. We must, we must coax him out, but this is the end of his season of hibernation. It will take much to rouse him. The food of a beast this size is exclusively banthas, and foolish hunters if we are not careful. To lure him out, we must lure his food to tempt him. How will we lead the Banthas here? They too have their food of choice. We must find some Bantha fodder to lead the Banthas here. I have a few ideas about where this may be found. Good thing we have some! In our pocket! Sand people keep Bantha herds, so some of them must have fodder on hand or in their settlement. A vendor in Anchorhead also has some. He had a kiosk in the spaceport. If you find fodder and bait the banthas here, the mines will deal with the dragon as it emerges to feed. Not exactly a glorious hunt, but it will ensure the safety of the region. If it were as simple as that, you'd have done it yourself. There is one added threat. The sand people regard banthas as sacred. Attempting to feed the herd in this area will likely lead to an attack. We are far from the weakened tribes around Anchorhead. The sand people of this region are strong, fierce, and will think nothing of killing you. Be careful. Oh dear. Look, I have your fodder. Good! Now there's a herd that moves out in the desert. Lead them here. Approach them with the fodder and lead them here. Oh no! No! But what if the sand people hate us now? No, I guess it doesn't matter. We can do this first and then go deliver the stick. The chieftain stick later. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. I wish you luck against the sand people. When you return, the dragon will fall. I wish I could be under more sporting circumstances, but we must do what the circumstances call for. I had hoped for a mirror of my father's expedition, but that will have to wait. So they're like, oh, is this like a place for us to put it? Maybe? Maybe? Nope. Oh, there's a bantha! Oh, there! Hello? We have food. This bantha perks up as you approach, obviously attracted to the smell of the fodder you are carrying. The whole herd falls into step. No! We're sacrificing them! Oh no. Oh no. Dang it. Buff us, Bastila! Zoom! Oh my gosh, I love having my Jedi crew. I love it! Come on! Come on, Liliana, you got this! Yes! I know, not the Bantha! I feel so bad! This is the worst. I feel terrible. Okay, I will lead you to your deaths. We made it! Good job! Come, talk to me! Do we really think this is going to work? <laughs> Okay, let's do it. Quickly, be ready. The Banthas are in position and will soon stir our restless prey. I hope the mines do their job quickly. Don't worry, I'm ready. Wait. What is that rumbling sound? Oh boy, he's a big one! I have a feeling we're gonna have to fight this dragon. <laughs> oh no! Oh dear. Oh dear. 
It's gonna be at like half health or something ridiculous. Oh gosh. Run, Banthas, run! Wait! We didn't even sacrifice the Banthas! It is done and the great beast is dead. To my shame, I denied him a final fight, but I will honor his memory to make amends. Wait, the Bantha are alive! I thank you for your aid, human. You have earned a share of the victory, such, a, such as it is. Wait, what? They lived! Why couldn't we have talked to the sand people and said, We're just borrowing these Bantha, we'll bring them back safe and sound. <laughs> Thanks, we did what we had to be- we did what had to be done. Regrettably so. I just hope you remember there were higher reasons for this. Don't let the spoils be your only reason to hunt. Wealth fades, the sands remain. I thank you for your help here today, human. I shall see you again, I am sure. But I hate sand. Oh my gosh, look at this beast! I feel like a little bad that we didn't... Like, take this down by yourself. It feels a little cheap. What did we get? What? Where are the remains? Ooh, a chewed human corpse. My favorite. <gasps> Jedi Master Robe? D what? What was a Jedi Master doing in here? Oh my gosh. Defense bonus plus three. Oh my gosh. We're a Jedi Master. <laughs> Not actually, but they could show you make it, right? And a, a violet crystal. We got a violet crystal. We can have a purple lightsaber now. <gasps> Wait, y'all, it's the star map. It's the thing. It's the thing. Oh my gosh. Yo. We did it. Whoa. Even after all the thousands of years it has been here, it still has tremendous power. Can you not feel it? The star map is an artifact of the dark side. The great dragon may have been drawn here by its dark power, though it be enslaved by it. Come, we should leave this place. There's nothing else for us here. Oh my gosh!